Alright, it's a Diplo. It does zero. Zero damage. Diplo? Oh god, I just made a- Alrighty guys, Gunshy Morai here with another video, and today we are going after the Rhino Nanthia. That's right. So, I did wait a couple days here, so that way I could have a lot more info once we got into this. So, as you may also be able to see here, I am using a new mod, which is the emote mod. Which, again, just hit my numpad and I can do emotes. So, it also expands all my emotes. Again, though, I do still have the normal... That's the wrong button. Do I? Yeah, I still have the normal play emotes. You know, got the circle... Hide hat, all that stuff. Yeah, see, I can hide my hat, and then technically I still have my tech helmet on. But now if I... I keep on holding the wrong button, I ain't gonna lie. Now I can show my hat. So, but anyways, this is a little visual bug here. But, as of right now, all I am waiting on is these baby car cars, which I just had hatch up. And, yeah... So, mostly what I have been working on here is I got one of my Quetzals. That is one of the creatures we got to. So, here's our new thing. So, the way this is going to be organized is I have the A through M in here. Legit, it worked out perfectly. The last creature in the M's alphabetically on the island is Moss Chops. So, that worked perfectly. That one is filled. So now we're over in here. We started on the O's, which is the Onyx, and now we're on to the Rexes. And after the Rexes, again, it's Rhino Nathia for the next slot, and then it's on to the next one after after R, which is, should be the S. So it's going to be Sabres and stuff. But anyways, um, here, I will scroll over that. That's the base stats of my Quetzal. Okay. Now, fully leveling this guy up by just feeding him some baby car cars. I just let it go, by the way. And, uh, so these two got leveled up by that. So, this is a max level car car. This Kakarodontosaurus, he's gonna be my personal mount for today. He's not getting sacrificed. Only those baby car cars are gonna get sacrificed, those three. So I'm gonna try and get three. Um, from what I understand, they steal, they steal stats from the host and the parent. So I need to watch the stuff I get. Um... Again, the, I did find a nice mod that would make a breeding for him, but it is via gestation because the Rhino Nathia is not in the creation kit yet. So, what I think I might do is hopefully they steal the good stats here from the car cars. I can get me a nice one that I can just hang on to because I'm planning on like the bees and the, uh, what is it? The bees and the ants, those ain't going to be breedable, all right? They're no-nos. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab one of each of those and just throw it in with my cloning stuff. And then once I got breedable Rhino Nanthia, I will clone them and then we will do mutations on one of them. Because I'd like to get a max level mutation Rhino Nanthia. And one of the options I thought about doing it is I think they will steal mutations. I honestly think they steal mutations. Um, I haven't looked much more into it. I just looked at, like, Syntax video. Where, it, like, they're clearly obviously stealing stats from the host, alright? Um, from the parents. So. Anyways. Uh, I will let... I will get these car cars raised up. And I'm pretty sure I'm out of meat. Oh my god. Woo! Okay, I have made a... Major judgment in air here and nearly messed up as well. I forgot to give these guys meat. So, that was actually a close call. They're still good. We still have a lot here on them. So, what I will do here is I'll just do that. Throw that back in. And here we go. So, you get some meat. You get some meat. And you get some meat. Okay. Nearly had a bad hiccup there, but we should be fine. Okay. So, I got my car cars all raised up now. They are max health. I did not put any levels in them, right? They're just going to be base. Um, I want to just see what happens if I give them sacrifices like this. Um, again, this actually cost me almost nothing in creature value. All right? So, what I think I should actually do here is this. Boom. 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 
boom. I want to double space in between this one and this guy, those guys, just so that way I don't accidentally sacrifice Kakarot, all right? So, Kakarot's good. I gave Kakarot their leftover meat. They did not need much of that, actually, so that turned out pretty well. Uh, but anyways, I'm going to hop on Quetzal, and now, this is probably not going to work, so I can't do it. What I'm going to do is, I know for a fact, by reconning it with Dez here, Dez back there a little bit, um, there are six, alright, and that was before I hatched the Car Car Eggs. And I know one of them was a 150, I just don't know if it was a male or female. So hopefully when we get there, we should be fine and everything works out. Um, hopefully that one is a 150, that 150 is a female. I'm going to try and find a nice level 10 male to take out first. That should be very helpful. Um, but yeah, let's get to it. Alrighty guys, so we got a Rhino Nanthia down there below me. Um, thing is, I don't want to get my Quetzal any closer than it is. I already feel like it's in a danger zone. I almost also forgot. Make sure you have your nets. Bring at least 15. Um, that's what I brought. Um, but, more importantly, I'm just taking off of the trap I saw in Syntax video for farming these guys. Where it was just five behemoth stone gates and a net. Or, well, the caves. Or the gates. Whatever. But I'm pretty sure this is our 150 down here. Now, if I... There it is. We've got it locked in. And it is a female. All right. That is going to be very, very helpful. But first off, before we get into actually taming this guy, we need to go kill a male. All right. Now, the males will drop us something called a pheromone gland. And with the pheromone gland, I should be able to basically... Uh, Give it to one of my car cars, feed it to him. But once we, only once, we have lowered the Rhino Nathia's health a bit, like a Reaper Queen to get her into the impregnation stance, alrighty? I don't know if she, like, gives off a pheromone like the Reaper Queen does, but hopefully we should be fine. Um, I do know that there is a level 5 over here towards the... Was it towards the green obelisk that is a male so we should be able to get that guy also you better be a high level you're not alrighty so I have moved my Quetzal over a bit more so there is our Rhino Nanthia that is the male we want to take down but first off we gotta hope no Capro is taken luckily I am wearing full tech so this shouldn't be a problem so I can legit just leave my Quetzal base up there unattended um i'm legit landing right on top of an alpha raptor i'm pretty sure no you're just like red you're an alpha raptor okay also uh we get like with this high level that there oh look at that like crystallization all right he encased that guy in resin so we're gonna be good here. I'm gonna just throw out Car Car. We're gonna let him drop and then we'll ride so that way he doesn't take any fall damage. Here we go. Now, Rhino Nanthia, hopefully, will just immediately target us. It appears that he does want that. So, hopefully. Alright, that was actually a one shot, and I'm pretty sure that's because we got two stacks. So, that's actually really good. Um, Kakarot, you are doing awesome. That is one. I am going to throw that on me. How long does that have on me? That has three hours. Alright, that will go up on the fridge here in Quetzal Base. So, let's get you cryopotted up. And I may as well, since how he, it, like, one-shot that dude. Let's go after another male. So. Alright. Uh, this, this is going to take a hot second. I feel like, you know, it actually rises faster than the cinema crops. Definitely. Definitely. And I can also do this. Which I don't think actually boosted me any. I mean, this probably does the same amount as the punch. Alright? And it's probably more efficient. But, yeah. Um, I don't know where the next mail would be. I'm gonna have to look. Alrighty, guys. Uh, I got my eyes on another one here. I don't know what gender it is, though. It's a male. Alright. We'll get in here closer. 
One thing I've been trying to avoid is getting the Quetzal in direct combat with one of these things. Because the Quetzal will die. Alright, this Quetzal has zero imprinting. Which I probably should have imprinted on this guy, but I didn't. Because I was raising other creatures at the time that I didn't want to worry about. Um, where did you go? I swear you were just in there. They're fast. They're like really hyper fast. Alrighty. Alright, this is as fat this is as close as you're getting here. Um, I'm gonna drop in and pop out Karkar or Kakarot. And we should be fine. So Now, he's somewhere in here. Now, if I'm biting and killing, I should get some stacks here and basically one-shot this guy. One thing I don't want to do is have him yo oh, target me and get me, like, frozen. Ooh, he's hitting me. Ooh, I hit something there. It's a Paraceratherium. He does not want me. He's going after that. Ooh, sneak attack! Ooh, this guy's a little bit harder to kill, but he still fell pretty quickly, just like all the others. Um, I think I'm gonna try and get one more male pheromone gland, and then we will try and capture that 150. Alright, I just got eyes on another one. This is probably a female, though. Oh. What are you? Come on. You have Torpor. Alright, you probably... Alright, you're a male. Um, uh, We're good. We'll just drop in here. Um, We're really close, though, to where the 150 was. Last time I saw it, it was actually on the other side of this island. Okay, I got eyes on him. Hopefully we can just, like, munch our way through. Like, they definitely, like, debuff the car car. Because it doesn't get, like, stacks from, like, bugs and stuff now. Uh, let's not walk in that puddle. I got a feeling that's what will crystallize us the fastest. I'm trying to keep my eyes on this bug, but it's getting dark. Right. Uh, I forgot I have a lock on. There we go. Game up. Right. There we go. We got him. We have, like, six... Oh, we have 16 stacks on the car car. That's probably why we just one-shot that one. I don't know if we had any stacks on the other one. I'm gonna actually use the car car to run closer this time, because last time it took me forever. I had to punch my way over so that way I had boost forward. Ooh, 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 ooh. Almost forgot. Almost forgot. Oh, don't bend down. There's snakes down there, dude. I don't want to have to deal with the snakes. You can deal with the snakes. See? It was a dimorph, actually, that made him that he's mad at him. So. Luckily, I can just mash the space button to get up, but you guys can hear me pressing the space button because of my mic. Because it's doing weird things. I don't want it to anymore. So. Alright. Now, I'm going to just throw all the pheromones in here. Okay? And I'm debating on what I want to do here. Because to trap her... I'm going to have to net her, but I don't know, like, where to do it. Because I don't want to do it in the middle of the swamp, you know? Because if I cryopod the creature to move it, it will die, alright? And I need a place where I could, like, lead it to. And honestly, I'm seeing a place right here in front of me, like, over in here, where I could do it, alright? I'm pretty sure, like, over in this area is where Syntax did it in his video. So I'm going to try over here. That would mean I'd have to lead that thing all the way over here. Or I could try and do it on this island, you know? That is an option. I'd like to try and farm this 150. I'd like to get three. Three of them and try and get three max levels, you know? But I don't know how this is going to turn out. I need to find that 150 female, honestly. That's probably the first thing I should do. Alright, she's in here. I'm honestly not joking. I swear I just saw another one. It's gotta be her. This was like the last location I saw her near. I just saw a pair of wings dive back down. She's clearly fighting something. I just don't know what. Now the last thing I actually want to do is actually get close to her. 
and then try and go back up to my quad soul. There she is. There she is. I'm locked on now. So, this is probably the stupidest idea, but I'm going to try and do that. How much did that do? Just that one shot. Tell me what that pellet did to you. That did a lot more than I would like. But it's also probably that Fionia that's messing you up. I could try and take her into the Redwoods. We, I'm comfortable in the Redwoods now, alright? I've overcome my fear of Thylos by living there. Alright, it's honestly, like, therapeutic what I have done. Alright? Next thing to do is snake therapy, alright? I'm terrified of them. Just throw me into a pit filled with, like, fucking gardener snakes. Leave me there for an hour. Five bucks, I'll, like, never be afraid of snakes again. Alright? I'm only saying five bucks because I will probably either get, like, severe PTSD from the Soviet situation. But, like, right now. Um, or... Uh, I will overcome my fear and just say, fuck it, there's snakes, let's get the hell out of here. One or the other. Um, also, this is probably a really good time just to do this. Alright, it's a Diplo. It does zero. Zero damage. Diplo? Oh god, I just made a... Reload, reload, reload. I'm backpedaling the fuck off. I don't have stemmy. I'm passed out. Well, it, if you like this video, please leave a like and subscribe because I just messed up and got knocked out by Troodons. Oh my freaking god. Alright, he's distracted by the Diplo. Okay, maybe we'll wake up in time. Okay, we okay, we just woke up. Where is he? Oh, she's still nearby. She's still nearby. Okay. So, we've learned. <laughs> I, I didn't realize that this thing disabled tech. That is, um... That is some serious firepower that she has against me now that I'm in tech tier trying to do this. Wearing full set of tech armor. Okay. I can't get stunned. I can't get frozen. That's the one thing I can't let her do to me is freeze. I need... What just happened here? What's going on? Oh, a lot of bad things, a lot of bad things, a lot of bad things are happening to me. Specifically, specifically to me right now. Oh! She's fast. It's like you're meant to combat tech. But I'm built to combat you right now. Okay, 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 we... Gotta get you guys away. You broke my gauntlets. Fuck you, giant snakes. Is that Mega Ethereum attacking? Oh, no. Okay, um, we gotta be quickity quack on this right now. Because I am 100% certain it might not work. Especially that I have a Terror Bird up my ass. I don't know how long we still have on this, uh, this pin. Okay, I'm getting fucked by nature right now. Honestly. Um, this is gonna this is the shittiest way I could have put this trap together, honestly. Just snap. Thank you. I mean He's in there. She's in there. She's contained. Um. It's legit a prison cell. Alright. There she's in the block. Okay. Now I need to be very careful with the way I do this. Pick up. Okay. That's the that one that one's a no-go. Um is this one a pickup? No, 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 no. It's not letting me pick these up. Okay. I mean... She's in there.
I mean, we got her contained. All right. Uh. Fuck! You are the last of my problems. Where is she? Did she get recontained? No, she's actually further. Thank you for sitting. Ah! There, everything is attacking me. All right, I need to rip apart this trap as fast as I can. Hopefully, it will start letting me pick up things like doors. Okay, please, please, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, if I can get this whole thing picked up and we can redo this trap properly without things attacking me, that would be so, so, so amazing. All right, that, that is legit all I am asking for right now. I just hit the cheat button. I hit the tab on accident. Okay, I meant to hit caps so that my caps lock would turn off. Okay. I'm standing right in front of a nest right now, and I don't know where my my guy is. I'm seeing Troodons freaking everywhere. This guy is going ham on the redwoods. Um, what I need to do is I legit. I don't have my. <laughs> my gloves so I can't punch. So this guy's way faster than me as well. I don't want to run around on the ground. Look, he's legit just like ripping. He's heading towards my base. Um. I mean, it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. I mean, I can rebuild the farm. But. If he... I could try and lead him to the base. There's a big old flat spot under the base. Car, car, you are going to help me now because I'm also getting tired of moving slowly. Kakarot, your time is here. Do, like, am I gammaed up? I am gammaed up. Oh my god, I didn't... I can't see. There's troodons everywhere. There you are, there you are. Oh my god. Hey, Kakarot wants to play, buddy. I need you to come and talk to Kakarot. I'm going to try and lead you up into the Redwoods. That's the plan. The plan is legit. Get you into the Redwoods and see what happens. Operation Fuck Shit Up is in go. No, no, Operation Fuck Shit Up actually doesn't work. Operation Get This Girl in a Pan. No, no that, that, that just sounds wrong. Okay. In fact, you are on me like butt cheeks. You are on my butt cheeks, okay? But I like it. Alright, it's a good thing. Kakarot. Stuck on a tree. You, you're fucking off. I can't have you fucking off. Legit, look. I, the plan, if I can get him up this slope, there's like so much stuff in my way though and I can't see anything. It's dark, it's foggy. It's legit like the worst scenario. And then he's, she's off doing that. I think I should get a flyer. I'm near base. I could get a flyer. Where did I leave Tech? Oh my god. Tech is around here somewhere just hovering. I don't remember where I left him. Or was it the Quetzal's around here hovering with all my stuff on it? And I forgot where I left him. Alrighty, guys. So I just messed up here. I forgot to record. So what happened was is once I had like, gotten Karkar there, he was turning around to head to the base, he came back and attacked me. And the only thing I could do was net him. And so, all I did was just throw the trap together real quick, alright? I mean, we are in a fairly good spot. We're up on a ledge, so... I mean, only thing that can get up to us is, like, Titana Boas that bug out. But I'm pretty sure I got the trap spaced properly this time. He shouldn't fly out or anything. So we're good. Kakarot, you are gonna be fine for this. Um, I need to double check what I need to lower his health to, so that way it will breed. Okay. I am pretty sure I just have to get it down below 20% uh, health. So what we'll do, 
We'll get in here. We'll net you. All right, all right, all right. Car, car, please fit, for the love of God. You fit, you fit, you fit. Okay, okay. Now, we're going to double check your health here. All right, 8,000, 8,000. All right, what I want to do is I want to hit you twice with my shoddy, just in your butt. All right, let's hit you once. Let's just hit you once and see what that does. All right. Two, three. All right, no more, no more. All right, let's uh, give you this. Nice. Okay. Now, we wait. All right. I should have probably put a saddle on the car car. Um, hopefully, uh, hopefully they do it. Syntax legit in his video. Again, I didn't watch like an official guide. I'm, I'm legit just going off of what Syntax had and uh, the stuff that they had available on the, what is it? The wiki for it. No. Okay, come on. How, how do I know if you've impregnated it? That's my thing. I mean, you're attacking. Here's the thing as well. You've also probably healed a bit. I don't want to do this. There we go. I think that's all I wanted to do. There! There! That is what I wanted to do. That is what I wanted to do. Okay. Now I need to... If I could, please... Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I need... I need a uh, Kakarot saddle. Alright. Uh, okay, it, 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 it's good, it's good. I need to steal Kakarot's saddle, though. Kakarot, I'm sorry, buddy. I need your saddle. I need to get this guy out of the taming pen fast. And here's the worst part. I can't use, uh... I'm stuck on top of it now. That's... That's a problem. I'm legit stuck on top of it. Hurry, 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 get away, get away. Ah, there we go. Perfect. Now what we do is we just sit back and we watch. What do you want? Does it say? Incubation time. Karkar will receive craving in 30 seconds. Okay. Now what we need to do is I believe I just have to have this stuff in my inventory. I don't have to have it hot barred or anything. So I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. I got split off half of you. Split off another half of you. Parkour eggs are still busted with my weight mod, so that they, they're not reduced at all. At all. Okay. Parkour craving in three, two, one. You're a curry. Nice. No. No. God damn it. Nature. Fuck off. Does that do anything when you get attacked? I I hope it does nothing to you when you get attacked. But I hate nature right now. <laughs> it is it's attacking me. Legit. Another one of these guys came out of nowhere. What what were you? As well. I didn't get a pheromone band. Or do you got one? You you got a pheromone okay. Um, I saw in the patch notes that they said that they fixed it so that these guys are dropping pheromone glands, only the males were. But it appears the females are still dropping pheromone glands. I have too much weight on me to jump. Oh my god. Um, hey, can you hold this for me real quick, my man? Thanks. Um, if the cops show up, run. <laughs> Things to say to your friends to terrify the hell out of them. Like, oh, oh, what do you mean? <laughs> but I think we should be fine here. Um, I really can't move from this location. We're stuck. Like, as long as this guy isn't pregnant, we cannot move. Alright? I can't get him up on a location. We're stuck here. But I'm glad that we brought that thing as, like, a mobile, like, feedery. I probably could have just thrown all this stuff in my inventory and flown around on Dez, you know? But I didn't 100% think this through. Alright, here comes the next craving. Hopefully I have the thing for it. Do I have the thing? Yes, I do. Perfect. Alrighty. Next one, next one. I'm gonna probably get like two more in this and then it should be good, hopefully. Yeah, I'm gonna have time for two of these before it pops. There we go. You wanted the stew. I'm gonna get the saddle off of you. Hang on to it. Uh, I can give it to Kara. 
to Kakarod Kakarot Kakarodontosaurus. So have you healed up any as well? My thing is is like do I have to heal her up or is like as long as she's low, can I farm her? I mean I probably have to hit her with my pike once or twice, but she's getting there. Um Where's where's your feeding? Oh! Oh! It only took like four things and then you're gonna pop. Are you dying slowly? Oh my yeah. Oh yeah. This dude's like sucking you dry. I'm betting with higher health. I wonder if you have more time. I wonder if the the time is based off of their health, you know? But I swear, like, I only had like ten minutes to do this. Not even that. I think eight. But, alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get back to you guys once he pops. Alrighty. It's the final countdown. Three, two, one... This is our first one, guys. Oh. Oh, that was gross. That was really gross. Ooh. Oh, you didn't get any of the parents' colors. Alright, we close that in time before... I actually don't even think it has audio. But a 217, what, what are your stats? Alright, you got the stamina. You stole the stamina. I like that. I like that. Um... Did you steal colors as well? That's my question. Because, like, now you're this nasty color. Your mother's a nice, like, vibrant green. Oh, do you steal colors? Oh my god, it steals colors. It legit... It took the parents' colors. Entirely. Oh my god. I didn't... Didn't expect that. Okay. Um, I only got a couple nets left... So let's do this safely. Okay, that's one. But probably for you guys, um, I'm gonna get these guys, well, you know, impregnated and then bred up. So they should be good. Is that another pheromone? I didn't realize I took out two pheromone bands. But what I want to do here is hit you three. I want to check. And we're gonna hit you with the pipe. There we go. I want to do one, two, three. Okay, we're good. We're good. Alrighty. I just wanted to lower her down a bit more. I think she'll be fine. She should impregnate the car car. Um, I'm going to get this reloaded. After she impregnates, do I want to hang on to her? No, because she'll despawn once I do a dino wipe. Um, I'm also hating that I got none of the colors from her on this guy. Like, I hate it. I mean, I'm glad I got the stamina stat. 100%. Like, glad you stole that. Okay. Alright, are you going to... Come on, you need to do the impregnation attack. I lowered you so you would. Okay, um... I would, I would hope that you would do it. Did it run off on the car car? Is it no longer... No, it still has it. Like, why won't you do it, though? Come on, just stay. I, I, I'm not worried about the car car. It has a lot of health. I'm worried about the Rhino Nathia. Okay, I want to do something here, and it's probably going to be stupid. Oh, he's targeting me. Oh, I can't get out on that side of the gate. All right, guys. No, I had to show you this one. Look at him. He popped out perfect. They stole all the good stats from the car car. Alright? They stole all the good stats. Also, I can't forget about this thing. I don't want to lose that. Oh my god, they sound weird walking too. You sound like you're armored, alright? Ooh, that is, that's awesome. Okay. I'm glad I got you. I'm glad I have you. Okay. I mean, we could go for another one. I do got another one here. That's the second one I bred up. Um, took a while though. It did take a while. Um, also, are you like you gotta let these things like fully heal to like get them to do? Ow! The one hole he shot through and hit me. 
the one hole. But anyways, um, I think this might be it for the episode. I got the stats I want on it. I got a nice, gorgeous colored one. Uh, I like I like these colors. Um, I think I'm gonna get Kakarot, Kakarot Cryote up here. Um, we're gonna. What am I trying to do here? Oh, I'm trying to put a cryopod, but I'm also trying to remember to put the saddle on him. So I don't know why I was trying to put the saddle in my inventory. I don't know. I'm confused now. But I think I'm going to just leave this guy here. Pinned up. All right. Leave him here. I might come back. I might try another one. But I'm thinking I might just clone the perfect one we got. It's going to be a little expensive. It's probably going to cost me like two Broodmother fights, but that shouldn't be hard. Those caves are really easy, especially with tech. Um, I need to get my tech repaired, though, for a uh, tech cave. Or, actually, this is the bad set. I need to get me a good set and paint it up. So, I'm working on leveling up the Helicoprion. I'm thinking about just, you know, what is it? Getting a bunch of car car eggs, hatching them up. Get them right there on the edge and try and have the helicopter on eat them. But that might not work as planned. But anyways, this is going to be it for the episode. So I'll catch you guys later.